These are Republicans who point to signs like this one here in downtown Tacoma, a business that thought it might reopen, scratch that out and says maybe they'll open by the end of the week. These are Republicans also from the Puget Sound area who have not been part of any protests before and say they believe the emergency is order and that's why they filed the litigation today. We're not diminishing the loss of life. We need to make that clear. What we're arguing is, is that we had a you know, an emergency arise. We needed to protect our hospitals to make sure they weren't overrun. We needed to get our resources in place, and we've done that rather successfully. But now it's time to focus with a scalpel rather than a sledgehammer on protecting those most vulnerable. The state of emergency was necessary at the time, and it is not necessary now. We still don't have the metrics from going from phase two to three to four and beyond. The governor said we were very worried that we'd overwhelm the healthcare system, that so many people would get so sick so fast, we'd run out of hospital beds, we'd run out of ICU space, we'd run out of ventilators. Uh, luckily, that didn't come to pass, but there are no longer any models. The governor doesn't even claim there are models that say if we lifted the shutdown, the healthcare system would be overwhelmed. But our concern is right now is that we're seeing this on a county by county area that it has diminished. Thurston County has had 100 cases, one death. Uh, businesses and families are being affected by this. The, the catastrophe that's happening to our economy, the fact that our budget in the state is going to be so severely impacted that we're not going to have the resources to take care of the most vulnerable in our state. We're not arguing to get rid of social distancing and changes at restaurants and those type of things, but we're saying let's let our businesses come to the table and see how they can open up safely so we can get money back in people's pockets. I spoke with House Minority Leader J.T. Wilcox, a Republican from Yelm today, who is not part of this litigation, but said he did welcome the challenge. He believed that reopening should be done on a county-by-county -county basis, and he also pointed to a Democrat, the governor of California, Gavin Newsom, who's already announced this week that they will begin phase two in the Golden State by the end of this week, including allowing the opening of certain retail outlets. That's the story for now live in Tacoma. I'm Chris Daniels, King 5 News.